Welcome collectors to another edition of Like a Hawk Cards. Just like Chris Jericho and it's apropos, I'm wearing a Chris Jericho shirt right now. It is apropos that I look at my list and check it twice because this is the list of Like a Hawk, I guess. Um, we are gonna check to see who has grand prize entries into the grand prize drawings for these three prizes. Next week, we're gonna do that drawing for those. And I need everyone that um, participated during the year to look at these and check to see if I did this correctly. So first I'm going to show who I have down for the grand prize entries because you won during the specific weeks. So we have for week one, I have S.A. Hudeville, Jared Weeks and 25 Perez. S.A. picked case 13, Jared picked case 17, 25 Perez picked case five. For week two, I have 25 Perez, Bruno Marion, and Frank J. Eddy the third. 25 Perez picked 12, Bruno picked two, and Frank picked 17. For week three, we have Cody Desch, 2904, and he picked case 13. Curtis, 1990, and Victor Negron cards, and Ronan Hall, 1970, all won in week four. Curtis, 11, Victor, eight, Ronan, 10. Nobody in week five won, so I have nobody for that one. Uh, week six, we have the Bears. Uh, Cousins Cards 3118, Bruno Marion 7151. So De Bears picked 16, Cousin Cards picked 12, and Bruno Marion picked 16. And then week seven, we had three winners. Jared Weeks picked 20, Silver Coin Outdoors picked 10, and Penguins Fans 9661 picked 6. And then in week eight, we had one person, Brian D5018, picked case 23. So those are the cases I have. If I missed your name and you believe that you won, put that in the comments below. If for some reason you want a different case, um, I'm gonna stuff the cases during this video, that's fine, put it in the comments. So any of those grand prize entries, let me know if I made an error. If your name is off and you think you won, now's the time to tell me. Um, all this stuff, I'm gonna be checking it um, almost daily, at least once, and then the cutoff is gonna be Monday night. So you need to watch this and get ahead. If I made a mistake, let me know. And then the people who participated in all eight, remember if you participate in all eight events, you get a free prize, grand prize entry. So regardless if you won, pick the correct pack, whatever, as long as you participate in all eight, you're gonna get a chance to win any of those prizes at the end of the year. So the people that I have that were in all eight breaks, that participate in all eight breaks were Josh Montgomery, Chris Tebow, Bruno Marion, Frank J. Eddy III, Chris Munez, Duncan Moss, Martin Claybo, Victor Negron Cards, S.A. Hudeville, Jared Weeks, Zombielands, 25 Perez, Tito the Alien, Wento, It Come Off an Egg, and DFW Hits 184, and Silver Coin Outdoors. So all of you need to tell me in the comments below what case you want for your participation entry. And I need that. If I don't hear from you, I'm just going to randomly roll, uh, I don't know, roll a D20 or whatever. We'll come up with something. And I'll give you another briefcase, and that's what you get. Um, if you already have a grand prize entry, pick a different case number. Don't, if you give me the same case number that you already have locked in place, I'm going to randomly give you another one. We want, I want you to have all different case numbers for all of your entries just to make the build kind of cooler that, you know, oh, I, the person who had case one picked it three times and that's the million dollar case. There's no way anybody else can win. We're, I want to try to make it kind of fun for that next video. So everybody that I just read off, you guys all get and gals get all a one case for the participation prize. Put that in the comments below. Again, you have till Monday night. There were a couple people that missed it just by one. Uh, Jess Winger Singh, um, Brian D5018, David V, to name a couple people. You just missed it by one. If for some reason I didn't mention your name and you think that you entered all eight, let me know in the comments. I will review it again. I try to take my time and go through everybody's list. Um, but if I miss something, now is the time to tell me in the comments below. So now that that is all said and done, we are going to stuff the briefcases, so to speak. These are all the different um, cash values that are gonna be in the 26 card. So you can take a look there. We're gonna have cases one through 26 right here. I'm gonna mix these up. I've never used these before in any game. I actually found this deck at a 
dollar store when it was a dollar store now it was up, up, it's up to a dollar 25 store um, and I thought I could use it for maybe some type of giveaway and um, I think this is kind of I, I like it exciting it adds another little feel instead of just doing a random and then randomly um, the computer is going to tell you who won there's a little more ownership um, at least I, I feel as a player to give me a number and then to kind of have it fate in your hands so to speak all right we'll cut you want me to cut all right i'll cut there since somebody said that all right so i will cut right there so the briefcases have been cut we are then going to mix up the cash cards do this right here again have never been used I'm, what i'm going to do is i'm going to put i'm going to sleeve these we're going to put them in our buried treasure treasure chest and then um, we are going to open them. I'll seal it with, with the official Like a Hawk card seal, which I've never been able to use. So this, that's kind of exciting that I was able to actually use one of those seals. Um, and then I'll kind of show you, we'll put them all in there and then I won't open it until next week. So let me show you what I'm gonna do. So we have the briefcase cards here. We have the money cards here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a briefcase card and I'm going to slide that on top of the cash card. Turn that over. Sleeve it up. And there's the first briefcase. I want to do this in a video so everybody can see that uh, everything's on the up and up here. So I'm going to do that. Um, while I'm sleeving these, we can talk about um, next year's laugh. Um, I honestly, I, I have four boxes if we're going to go that route. I have three Chronicles hobby boxes, and I have a, a Road to Mesomania one, which I believe has the Roman Reigns rookie cards or his first auto. I have to take a look at that. So... Um, I'm interested in what people want for prizes next year because Panini stopped doing their, stopped producing WWE cards. I don't know when they're going to be back. And prices have gone up a little bit on Undertaker autos and other things. So I need help in what should be prizes next year. I was thinking of just doing um, two $100 eBay prizes where you, it's almost like a, a big Berry treasure where you tell me what card or cards to buy for that hundred dollars and then I'll just buy the cards for you and have have eBay ship it to you um, so that way you can get them right away and the nice thing about that is if you collect something else besides wrestling um, you don't have to spend the hundred dollars on a wrestling card you can buy a baseball card if you want to speculate on a rookie or a MLB rookie Bowman card Bowman first card or um, something like that. Uh, let me know if that's something that you would want. Do you want boxes of cards? Are there specific superstars that you would want? I, I try to do um, superstars that everyone would want, and that would be within the price range. So, um, you know, I can't do, I don't know, like at a national, no, they didn't do national treasures, an immaculate quad auto that's a thousand bucks i can't do that um once the, if the channel ever gets that large i would love to be able to hand those out or a rock auto i can't do that um but prizes superstars that you would like to see autographs that i give away or um, boxes of cards do i give away um, any ideas for prizes or do you like the idea of where i give you a certain amount of money that you get to spend however you want on ebay and then i buy that for you and ship it to your to your house um, that way i don't have to ship anything that's nice on my end and then you can get whatever you want it doesn't even have to be wrestling so um yeah let me know let me know what you think um, also let me know do you like this whole briefcase idea is there a better way that I can do a random? Um, any way that you would switch up the contest for next year? I have not done anything live because I'm kind of, I always, I'm wary of that because I have never done it before and I don't know if I like hit the camera or screw it up. Um, I'm not using a phone. 
I'm actually using a camera to record my videos. So I believe that should still work because I bought a USB cable to hook that up to the laptop. Um, but I don't know how well I'd be able to watch the comments with my with the way I'm doing it because I have a laptop, laptop off to the side and then I'm looking forward. So it'd be really hard for me to um, watch comments while I'm doing it live. But maybe I'll maybe I'll do one live at some point just to test it out. Um, but any thoughts on the whole laugh season? Um, do you want me to take a break from laugh? I'm, I'm open to whatever comments you have about the whole thing. So, um, yeah, let me know. We have one more suitcase here. And then we are good. So the last briefcase, <laughs> the last briefcase is number one. So we are going to, all right, so these are all sleeved right here. Okay, so we have those on the backs, cash card. So no one can see any of these. So let me stick those there. I'm now going to get the briefcase out. We are going to open, or not the briefcase. I do have a money in the bank briefcase, but we'll, we'll just do the buried treasure for now. We'll stick these in here. Close that flap. And so you can tell if I'm opening this. You see that little, it would rip right there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a seal right there. The official Leica Hawk Cards seals. I've yet to use these. Use that. We're going to stick that right there. Adhere it down firmly. So that is in place. Have the lock there. So that's in place. I'm just going to leave there. Hopefully I don't bump the table so you can tell that it's in the same place as it is when we come back um, next week. So next week I'm actually going to do the drawing. So again, you have this uh, less, next five days to tell me um, if I screwed anything up with your entries. Go over the case numbers. See if I pick, gave you the right case number. Did I screw up your participation stuff? If you do get a participation entry, give me a case number below in the comments. Otherwise, you're going to get a random briefcase. Um, just let me know all that and any thoughts you have on doing Laugh Next. Should I take a break? Let me know any of your thoughts on the Laugh Contest as well. So I really appreciate checking out this video. Like, subscribe. Tell me about your hits in the comments. What have you been up to recently? And, of course, your social media, Instagram, at Cards, all one word. Hope you have a lot of luck in your next break. And thanks for watching Like a Hawk.